if he can stay on the field, they believe he is a game breaker. He's been unable to do that for the last couple of years. And a quarterback will keep it. DJ off to the races and picks up a big first down and a gain of 19 on that scamper. Shipley in the backfield, Spectre in motion. Shipley straight on, straight on, busts a couple of tackles and picks up a first down. This is DJ's team. This is his team, and he's in a good place. And the coaching staff and the players are really responding well to him, and he's off to a good start this season. And running the football here as well on the carry. Not everything has to be a fastball. We know he has a big arm. That's a nice touch there. On play action, plenty of time. Great protection. Throwing long, and a diving catch on that far sideline. A 41-yard toss. Take a look at this grab. It's a great throw by DJ. Nice, accurate ball. And then Joseph Ngata, who Davey said it earlier. So second and goal here for the Tigers. Knocking on the door here in front of a packed house at Death Valley. Shipley again. Right in the pile. And he goes. He is in for a touchdown. Will Shipley... Our thoughts and our prayers are certainly with the Brazil family. Tigers on top 10 nothing here in the first as the Bulldogs look to keep it on the ground here. McNeil will throw over the top here and it's going to be complete. Now we're going to be caught by Hebert his tight end and we'll pick up a first down. That's his favorite target. Minor injuries right now. McNeil will air this one out. They're going to try a little trickery here as well. And a long, long heave, and that's going to be intercepted. Intercepted by R.J. Mickens. In social media, rarely kind or reasonable or even sane. He's going to hand off, but LaTex saw that coming. Toby Pace taken down quickly. Going to lose two yards. He's in a really good place right now, and he's played like it so far. Yeah, much better place than a year ago. Back to throw. Pressure. He's going to be taken down. And by Jaden Cole, who'll pick up his first sack of the year. And that's going to be blocked. Blocked by the Tigers. They blocked a couple of punts this season. Bar Carter comes away. He lets it loose. That's on the deck. And the Bulldogs say they have it back. And they do indeed. So Clemson recovered it and gave it right back to La Tech. Big Cinco back to throw. Downfield, and that one is going to be completed. Caught by Antonio Williams. Very talented freshman out of Irmo, South Carolina. It's because they're good at every level, and I think that's the key for them defensively. It's not just the D-line. He wants to throw very deep and has a receiver for a major league completion. Big-time effort there in the catch by Lewis. Yeah, Julian Lewis just gets inside, runs a post route, and there was nobody in the middle of the field, and that's a heck of a throw. But Parker McNeil just drops it right in there. Good protection up front. Night. Second and ten for La Tech. McNeil to step up. Pressure from behind. He's going to be dragged down by the Tigers. As they get to the quarterback, that's Miles Murphy. Third and forever. Make sure you don't make a mistake backed up. Going fast again. In the pocket, he'll rifle that one, and it's going to be picked off. Intercepted again, the second one of the ball game by the Tigers. That's Trotter, Jeremiah Trotter, from the 32-yard line. Young Lale with the handoff, and Shipley's going to break free. Across the 10, he's into the end zone for a touchdown. 32 yards. Will Shipley. And punches in six for the Tigers. LaTeX trying to answer behind McNeil. They'll rifle that one complete. Slicing it up ahead and across the 50-yard line. That is Bear, the tight end. He's a former wide receiver. Runs like it. On a play fake. And a nifty catch on the play there. Trey Harris. That's just complete number three. Louisiana Tech has to do attack these corners. I mean, that's Jalen Lucas, and he's got no idea where the ball is. True freshman out there against Trey Harris, who's... Uh, Tiger defense making a statement here early 
in the second half and have a total of three interceptions. And here's Shipley again. Shipley getting the edge. He's outside. And a big gainer. He's able to find the tight end. That's a nice job by DJ of seeing it. And Mappa will dive into the end zone for a touchdown. From four yards out. So first and ten for the Tigers. Louis Ungalale with Kobe Pace in the backfield with him. And lining up to throw. And he's got a receiver open. That'll be Collins. And he is in for a touchdown. Bo Collins with the grab. But it also is a nice reward for the players that they recruit here. And even the walk-ons, which obviously Dabble was. McGill with the strike gets it out there to his tight end, Bear, And a long, long run after the catch for a big first down. You know, snaps like this and situations like this are helpful. Crosby driving the goal line, churning, churning, and he's going to bowl in for the touchdown. La Tech on the board again. That one from three yards out. Marquise Crosby with a touchdown. It's been a good start, but certainly a lot of football left. The deal for the end zone and in there for a touchdown. And a catch made by Trey Harris on the leap from 13 yards. Well, this one's starting to tighten up here. Sheridan Jones's injury, you know, he's really wanted to sit on things tonight, and it's been easy. High five and all of his guys, too. You can see the mood here has definitely shifted as they've gotten this game close in the first. Shipley, big hole opening up across the 50. Tripped up as he got across the 40 yard line. DJ to loft that one for the corner. That's going to be caught, but was he in? It is a touchdown. Do a great job of winning on the round necessarily. Doesn't leave much room for his quarterback, but it's a really well thrown football by DJ. That's the score. And Parker McNeil has shown oh, this one's free. And Clemson's gonna dive on the football. With five minutes left in this contest. And off for pace, dancing inside. He'll dive in for the touchdown. A three yard touchdown run by Kobe Pace. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus.